What's up, everybody? Jason here for CaseBreaks.com. 2020 Gold Rush Autograph Full-Size Baseball Helmets just sold out. It is a four-box case break. Random players number two. And you can chase some really, really good names, guys. Including Mike Trout, Cody Ballinger, Cal Ripken, Bo Jackson, Vladimir Guerrero Jr., Wander Franco, Yelich, Chris Bryant, Judge, Itro, and many, many more. And again, it's a 26 total spot break. Everybody gets two random players from the list below, so we're going to double up your names. Right here. So from Josh down to Michael. And then we got Judge down to Jordan Alvarez. Let's roll the dice. And we got a six and a three nine times. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. Boom, nine times. Arthur down to Logan. There you go. Six times, or nine times, sorry. Now on the players. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Nine times. Ichiro down to Chris Bryant. Whoa. All right, let me just alphabetize by customer name. Makes it go by a little quicker. All right, you got Ichiro, Jordan Alvarez, Asa. You got Sheffield, Boggs, Guerrero Jr., Goose Gossage, Aaron Judge, Andre Dawson, Jim Palmer, Pete Rose. Brady, you got Tom Glavin, Jim Tomey. Brent, Yelich, Trout, Fred Lynn, and Nolan Arenado. Brett Myers with Cal Ripken Jr., Vladimir Guerrero Sr., Pete Alonso, and Addison Russell. Derek with Barry Larkin, Juan Soto. Felix, you have Cody Bellinger, Wander Franco, James, Ivan Rodriguez, uh, Frank Thomas, Jason. Walker Bueller, Harmon Killebrew, John, you got Bo Jackson, Glaber Torres, Jose Ramirez, Mark, Mike Yastrzemski, Josh, uh, you got Andrew Jones, Chipper Jones, Josh Melton, that was excellent, Melton, you have Paul Goldschmidt, Manny Machado, Logan, you got Tatis Jr. and Chris Bryant, Marty with Bill uh, Mazeroski and Alan Trammell, Michael Watson, Las Mojo, Jeff Bagwell, Jim Edmonds, Michael Wheeler, you have Carlton Fist, Mike Piazza, Rick with Reggie Jackson, uh, Reggie Jackson and Sparky Lyle. And Ryan, you have Smoltz, Robles, Ozzy Smith, and Roberto Alamor. Alamor. And Tyler, you have Trevor Hoffman and Charlie Sheen. So, again, I'll leave it like that for the next minute or so if you guys want to make any trades. And then if not, um, we'll close the trade window. So, actually... up in the meantime we'll allow you guys to trade if you guys want to if not close the trade window I'm assuming nobody wants to trade then, right? TWC. All 
Alrighty, guys. Good luck. Alright. Good luck, guys. First one. Let's rip it open. Before I show you guys, last little printout of everybody in the break. And what players you guys got. Before I show it, let me do this. All right, who am I, guys? I'm an American baseball player, and actually former baseball player. Actually, as of now, I'm actually a coach. Born May 27th, 1968. I was a first baseman. Played my entire 15-year career with one MLB team. Originally drafted by Boston in the fourth round selection from the University of Hartford as a third baseman in 1989 amateur draft. Then traded to the team I played for the rest of my career. I won Rookie of the Year in 1991. Also won the NL Most Valuable Player in 1994. Was a four-time MLB All-Star, three-time Silver Slugger Award winner. And a gold glove recipient. Um, I say Jeff Bagwell. Yes. I would say that too. I mean, I wouldn't know. <laughs> <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah, my career bad average was uh, 297, 2,314 uh, hits, 449 home runs, 1,500 RBIs. And damn. 86.2, seventh ballot inducted in 2017. Damn, it oh, took him seven be, times? Jeff it took him seven times? Is it Jeff Bagwell? Yeah, it is. Nice. That was that, that was like one of the one of those like one of those things where people were just like, oh, why the Red Sox trade him? What could have yeah. been? Why you know, it's like one of those famous kind of trades. Or infamous kind of trades. Because he went on to be a Hall of Famer. There you go. This one actually feels like a real helmet. Uses that batting cages. There you go. So Jeff Bagwell is Michael Watson. That was last spot mojo as well. Nice. And I'm sure you got the COA in there somewhere. There you go. Whoop. Next one, guys. Give me somebody that I would know. Alright, I'm a former center fielder in the MLB and current broadcaster for Fox Sports Midwest. Ooh. Um, born 1970, like I said, center fielder, played for one, two, three, four teams, five, six teams actually. Center fielder. From 1993 to 2010. 93 to 2010. It's a long time right there. Known for his defensive abilities, was a prolific hitter batting 284 and 393, 393 home runs and an on-base plus slugging percentage OPS of 903. And affectionately known at, by 
this team as Jimmy Baseball and Jimmy Jim Ball Evans. Game. And they, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Ixline said it first, though, actually. Oh. But, yeah. There you go. And not a Hall of Famer, but four-time All-Star, 2006 World Series champ, eight-time Gold Glove Award winner, and St. Louis Hall of Fame, Cardinals Hall of Fame. And yes, Jim Edmonds. There you go. Very nice. There's the auto. There's the COA JSA. And Jim Edmonds is also Michael Watson last bomb mojo. Wow. wow. <laughs> your two t your two team or two players you got or two T of players you hit. All it takes is one, guys. To get two hits. It's crazy. Bagwell and now Jim Edmonds. Did Fox Sports Midwest give it away when I said that, Josh? I think you said. I think you typed it in right after I said that. I didn't realize he was. So many team broadcasters pulling did, did he do? Maybe did he do Angels broadcasters over there? Well, he did play for the Angels, so I'm not sure. Maybe Mark, Mark Gubiza, I think, still does Angels. So. Oh. All right, third one, guys. Ah, because you're a huge Cardinals fan. All right, there you go. I feel like that must have gave it away. <laughs> All right, third one, guys. Oh, this one doesn't have a sticker. How am I supposed to know who this is? Oh, it's over here. All right, former MLB baseball player and a right-handed relief pitcher. Played 22 years in my baseball career. From 72 to 1994. Pitched for nine different teams, but spending his best years with two teams. I can't even say his nickname, because I'm sure it's going to be an easy... Goose, Goose <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, his nickname is Goose, <laughs> which is also his first name. I was like thinking like 72 to 90, <laughs> or like early 90s. Yeah, yeah, 72 to, yeah, yeah 72 to 1994. Came about when a friend did not like his previous name, Goss, and noted he looked like a goose when he extended, <laughs> his, when he extended his neck to read the signs. Give him my picture. <laughs> That's funny. So there you go, yes. And I am a Hall of Famer in 2008, 9th ballot, 85.8, .8, and I'm a nine-time All-Star World Series champ in 78. Um... And yeah, three-time AL saves leader. So yes, I am Goose Gossage. Beautiful auto. JSA in there. Goose Gossage is going to Asa. Oh, I'm pinging my finger. All right. So there you go, Asa. Congratulations. How many times do you think Goose Gossage actually wore a batting helmet? I don't think Like in know. a real game. He's a reliever mostly for American League teams, right? Oh, that's right. So he doesn't even... So it's like he almost... Even, he doesn't even... Has he ever that. played for an NL team? Do you have it up? I have it right there. Oh, okay. Pirates, Padres, Cubs, Giants. Pirates, maybe? They, they might have... Just I mean, throwing him in for that inning and then took him out. Right, exactly. He's, like, <laughs> he's usually a closer. All right, so. last one. I know that's so funny though, right? Like some players probably have never batted. Like, and they have ever, to take like, like no, real, no like, batting practice. Yeah, like, aside from batting practice maybe, but I don't think in a real game he's ever worn a batting on. Well, at least he could be good at one thing then. That's right. All right, good luck guys. Last one. Last, last one. And we have a number three up on the website. I'm sure we'll do a handful of these. Last one. I am a former major leaguer outfielder who played with eight teams from 1988 to 2009 and currently works as a sports agent. 
if any of you guys know sports agents. Played right field, but he also played left field, third base, shortstop, and a handful of games at first base, so he was very, uh, very good at different positions. Uh, he played for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine teams, like I stated earlier, and was a first round pick of the Brewers, who selected him six overall in 1986 amateur draft. He bats and throws right handed. And uh, career batting average of 292, had over 2,600 hits, over 500 home runs, and over 1,600 RBIs. Yeah, not in the not in the Hall of Fame, but he's a nine-time All-Star, World he's Series champ. Minutes. Yeah, I didn't Dave even know Parker? that. No, Kevin got it. No, nine-time All-Star. Yeah, five-time Silver Slugger and All Batting Champ. He's a sports agent. Yeah. I was gonna say Dave Stewart, but he's a pitcher. Yeah. And you guys are all right, Chef. Who got it? Gary Sheffield. First one was Kevin. Gary Sheffield's a yeah, he's a sports, sports agent, agent, I guess. <laughs> According to Wikipedia, he is. Wow. And you have him in his Dodgers edition, too. Oh, there you go, Chef. That bat waggle, though. There you go. And there's the JSA in there. The auto. Gary Sheffield is Asa again. Wow. wow. Man, two people just got two hits. That's crazy. Just to show you guys. Also, Gary Sheffield for Asa. And there you go, guys. That was the break. This was Autograph Gold Rush Full Size Baseball Helmets Four Box Case Rape Random Teams Random Players Number Two. Number Three is on the website. I'm sure you'll do a hand form tonight with Joe. I believe Tribute Pikachu Number One is close to selling out. If not sold out, so Joe will step in and do that in a few minutes. Appreciate it, guys. Have a great night and uh, well, great rest of your day. Great night.